Welcome to the Windows and Computer Channel and this is a quick rant I will say for anybody that has a, a gaming laptop for example that has two GPUs it's one of the common things today um, you know for a long time if you bought a gaming laptop you had a laptop that had a dedicated graphics processor and that's it today laptops and a lot of computers that are gaming computers come with a general uh, gaming GPU but also a general um, regular GPU from Intel most of the time so for example my laptop in Acer Nitro 5 has a Intel UHD graphics GPU but as also a Nvidia GTX graphics GPU that is in charge of gaming problem is is that for a long time that was fine because you could actually choose manually the graphic GPU you want for an app for example easily by right-clicking the app so you would just go to an executable right-click the app, the uh, the executable and in that choice you would have uh, run with high performance graphics now a lot of you have come to me and said well you know you had that video where you were showing how to choose the graphics GPU and I don't find that option one of the sad op things that happened when we moved to version 2004 um, and uh, October 2020 update sorry um, version 20h2 and I believe version 2004 might have lost it after a while too is that when you moved on you lost that capability and that is really sad because um, I am for example one guy that is a little old school and there are some graphic demos that groups actually do that I like to actually watch and I like to see you know the innovation and the graphics and music and all and what's nice is I would just download the, the demo right click on the executable and run with the Nvidia GPU it was easy no problem now things are getting complicated because they removed that option in the menu you now have to go to settings you have to go in those settings to the system tab and here at the bottom you will have what is graphics settings and in here you'll be able to choose apps so now for example all of this uh, for example here the X-Men high performance asphalt high performance you gotta choose the app and you gotta choose in the options what GPU is gonna run it and this I mean it's fine for a game for example because you you specify the game and that's it not not much of a problem it's fine for some apps that sometimes you want to force that they could use the graphic um, you know the uh, graphic GPU you want but the in the options where you download a graphic demo like I did or you download something that you just want to try it's more of a pain in the butt because what happens is that now you need to always go through this menu every time you want to uh, have an acceleration with the proper GPU and the last rant I'll have with this is that even though you choose it it's 90% of the time it works but there's a small percentage of apps that don't obey the law or the rule of the GPU so unfortunately that is a rant that I have because the right click was a very easy way to just try it out and um, you know have it working with the proper GPU unfortunately it doesn't happen anymore because you can't do that anymore which is sad so once again if you want to add an app for your GPU your graphics processor of choice you have to go into settings you have to go into system then here at the bottom you have graphics settings and then what you do is you browse to go and get your desktop app or you have Microsoft Store app availability which is uh, sad because it's a little more difficult to actually have it working properly if you enjoy my videos please subscribe give us thumbs up thank you for watching